City of Liverpool, Matthew Parks. In lane number one, representing Lincoln Vulcans, Jack Berno. In lane number two, representing the City of Cardiff, Ewan Lloyd. Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, your boys, 17 and 18 years, 400 meters freestyle finals. Miles Crouch Anderson in lane four from Northampton Swimming Club. Setting up an age here, 17 years of age now. He is the British record holder for 15 years on 357.17. Anderson's lifetime best now is 355.42. It's Jones at the moment with a good start, representing SX3 Swindon. Oh, 27.11. Not much in it though. 27.11. Stroking out here, almost in a line. But just in case you didn't hear it. Jones in three, just about ahead, but as I speak, that's beginning to change. Anderson's making his uh, presence felt, so he's housed at the city of Cardiff in lane five. And as they turn, it's Jones on 56.98, four one hundredths quicker than Howes in lane five, and then one hundredth be behind Howes, it's Anderson in lane four. Anderson looking as though he uh, he's teeing himself up for a bit of a tilt at the head of the race here, but they're all in the line. It's an intriguing final list. Here they come. So it looks like there's a change in the fortunes. There is. Anderson now ahead, 127.12. So by 0.2 of a second, he has now gone ahead of Harris. 127.7. Oh, the swimmer still look as though they're keeping the powder dry for concluding sh sharp dash for the line. But this is the turn of the midway point. Anderson there looking really in form. Still turning first. 157, 13, 0.3 of a second quicker than Howe, so 157.9. Oh, no, yeah. Looking as though he means business, coached by Jackie Marshall then, and the soon representing the Northampton Swimming Club. Fastest man in the field with that 355.42. But still not having it all his own way, Howes of the City of Cardiff is still going with him, although he's losing ground. It's not much, but he is losing ground. Howes in five on Anderson in four. Now then, starting to make his presence felt, it's a swimmer in lane two. That's Yayan Lloyd from the City of Cardiff. Yayan Lloyd's got a 357.46 PB. And Lloyd is another man that cannot be discounted in the concluding stages. And it's those three that are going to turn in the top medal positions. Which way are the medals going to go before the conclusion? Well, you tell me, because Lloyd is now really starting to come through to pressurise Anderson. Come on, yeah, 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 yeah. The penultimate 50. Lloyd trying to take the lead away from Anderson, but Anderson has realised the danger, and he's now once again injecting more pace, and Anderson looking good, and so is Lloyd as they're coming up to the turn here with 50 metres to go. Lloyd, I think, is just about ahead. He is. Lloyd has now got the lead, 326.56, only 14 hundredths of a second over Anderson, but that could be enough to seal victory. 25 metres to go. And these two swimmers really are beginning to bury themselves. It's Lloyd from the city of Cardiff, coached by Dave Haller, that's got his eyes in front. Anderson trying to come back at him. He's going to run out of distance. It's going to be Lloyd that will take this. Lloyd, the 17-year-old, will take it. He does on the top. Take the time. 
Laurie, 354.90, a personal best time for him. Andrew Anderson from Northampton on 55.25, a personal best for Anderson. And the bronze medal going to Alexander Jones of Swindon on 357.52, another personal best. And now we can see the official results on the scoreboard from the boys 17 and 18 years Forage and Beaters Freestyle Final. Oh,